Hi you guys! Welcome back to my channel. It's Aaliyah Monique and we are gonna do a quick little unboxing and review. Okay y'all? So let's get right into it. If you are new, please join the family and subscribe and join because we fun over here, okay? Look. <laughs> So let's get right into it. So we are going to be reviewing Max Trendbox. And this is the color that we are going to be reviewing. So let's get right into it. So yes. Okay. So this is the card. Ooh, isn't that so pretty? Ah! Oh, um, and then these are the items that are inside. Hey, like, let me put this box down. I'm struggling, y'all. Okay, really quickly. So we got the retro matte liquid lipstick in the color caviar period which is this black shade we also got the new squirt plumping lipstick plumping gloss stick in the color jet and we got a clear gloss which we love right so let me take this little lippy off really quickly and then i'll be right back all right y'all so we have a clear base and we're gonna start off with the um what's it called we're gonna start off with the Squirt Pump. Why well, keep on saying? I think that I'm very inappropriate, so that's why I can't say it like normal. <laughs> so Squirt Plumping Gloss Stick in the color Jet. Okay. This is how it looks. This is how the tube looks. And you twist it like this to get product up. You see. Now, I was told to not lift it up too much because then too much product will come out. So let's just do a nice little soft base. Let's see. Okay, so you have to really be really gentle when applying it, okay, y'all? Because this thing will... You'll waste a lot of product. I love this. Mmm. I just like how it looks. Like it's supposed to be black. But it's not. I'm going to try to layer it to see if I can get a little bit of color or pigment from it. Okay. So you can tell that some of the product has eased on the sides. So that's what they mean when they say that you're gonna waste a lot of product if you push it up too high. I'm not gonna lie, this might be one of my go-to lip glosses right now. Only because I really, really like how it's giving me a gloss with a little bit of black. So it's like a hint, because my lips are already dark, it's a nice, I don't know how to, it looks nice on my skin tone. That's really the only thing I could really say. Let me come in closer so you guys can get a little, you know. Okay, so this is close. I'll zoom in a little bit more, but you guys see what I'm saying? Like, it's giving a gloss. You can definitely tell that it's a little, like, it has a hint of black in it. But it's really, really a nice lip plump. Not like other lip plumpers where it will tingle and burn, like that normal effect that we think that it should have, which is secretly not normal at all. Nothing should be burning on your lips. <laughs> but this one, it gives a nice sensation where it's bearable. You aren't like, it's not, it's tolerable. I really love this. It kind of feels like peppermint. Mmm, 
was giving like a pepper a peppermint vibe on the lip i really love this okay okay so i had it on for about three to five minutes and it definitely is not going to burn or have like the same exact effect as the other lip plumper brands but i do notice that my lips are getting bigger i could definitely tell in my cupid's bow area I love how it's making my cupid's bow look it's giving me what i want because I, I love like rihanna's lips and her cupid's bow is very noticeable so that's my goal i normally put a lot of at the top so it can poke out the way i want it to so period okay so let's try the liquid matte and see if we like it so let me take this off really quickly and i'll be right back okay so we have the retro matte in the color caviar which we love I am a black girl, if you can't tell. Um, so this is how it looks. Super sleek. I'm gonna mix it around inside a little bit, you know, a little bit, a little bit. Okay. y'all so this is how it looks dry um i love i don't know about y'all but this is definitely like a beat now i'm not gonna lie what i was just thinking while i was putting it on is so cute is you know the vamp lip is what the people the girls been doing which is like a black liner and a red in the middle so i would definitely do that with this because it's like a perfect black i'm not gonna lie All right, y'all, so this is how it looks fully, completely dry. I've had it on for about five minutes. It is not tacky at all. That's why we love MAC, because MAC knows how to make a matte lipstick, okay? You can put both of your lips together and it's not gonna be sticky. It has completely dried. Now, I have not done the transfer test, so let me try that to see if it transfers when you put your lips on something. Okay, so it does transfer. It's not completely matte. Maybe it needs to dry down just a little bit, but on the photo, she's really glossy. So I'm gonna try to do this with the gloss that they gave me as well. So let's get a little glossy black lip in real quick. And let me do a quick zoom in so y'all can see how the black really looks on my lips. Now this is me, this is how it looks now that I just patted a little bit of it off. So it definitely is not as pigmented, but I really do like it. I like, I think it's like a perfect soft black. Like this is, what is this called again? Caviar? Yeah, this is like a true, true black. This has no types of hint of blue, if you know what I mean. Like it's not a blue black, it's a full black lip. So we love that. Um, okay, so let me put the little gloss on so y'all can see how it looks glossy. I can't believe it's raining. y'all this is how it looks with the gloss on it i love it i don't know okay this might sound crazy but i feel like i'm like Catwoman. you know giving a real like her and it matches my nails period okay let me zoom out okay so this is a zoom out this is with my full face 
Now, I definitely could wear this all day, all day, every day. Like, this could be my go-to lip. I really do like it. Oh my God. Okay, so honestly, I give the matte lipstick a 10 out of 10 just because it is not sticky when it gets dry. Now, it is transferable, so if you do drink something or, you know, kiss somebody, they gonna have black on them or the cup gonna have black on them. Black on it, you know what I'm saying? But it's definitely giving a vibe. I might wear this for fashion week. I might do an all black little outfit with the black lip. But it also could be this little side part that I got going on. It could be giving it real oomph, you know? But yeah, I'm definitely in my villain, villain era. This is what this lip is. Villain era. Comment below if you guys have tried the squirt plumping lip gloss stick. I think when I say squirt, it's giving me a, the wrong, you know, connotation. But y'all know what this is, okay? So let me know if y'all tried this squirt lip plumping gloss stick. Or if you guys have tried the retro matte. Because both of them are 10 out of 10. Now, I would wear... This is my go-to when I'm walking my dog. Or just want to go out real quick and I need a little quick gloss to make my lips do what it got to do. And then this is like if I'm trying to... Which one is your favorite? Which one did you like on me the most? My favorite is the black matte retro. I love. I love it with the gloss on it. The gloss definitely did what it had to do. We're not playing. Like, this should be in everybody's go-to anyway. Like, this matte gloss is like chef's kips, okay? So, I'll see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Join the family. Turn your post notification bell on so you can be notified every time I drop a video. Literally, you're going to be the first one to know that I drop the video. It's going to come in your emails. It's going to pop up on your notification on your phone. So, turn that bell on, and I'll see y'all in my next one.